Hello there, it's Rebecca from Be Naturally Fit, and welcome to my morning sadhana practice. So I'm going to lead you through some yoga, um, Kundalini yoga, that is perfect for waking up in the morning. This is actually a condensed version of my set, so I'm super excited to share it with you and give you this powerful practice that will allow you to just take charge of your day. So I'm here filming in Costa Rica. You may hear the monkeys or birds or bugs throughout this video, but I think it's a very beautiful soundtrack to have in the background. So coming into a very comfortable seated position, bring the palms together and just start to rub them. We are gonna tune in with Om Namo, Guru De Namo, which just means I'm connecting to the infinite source of wisdom in the universe and the divine teacher within. Inhale, press the palms together, pull your spine up nice and straight. And exhale, inhale to tune in. Oh, no. Now inhale very deeply, keep your eyes shut, press the tongue to your root of your mouth, pull up through your mudaban, so your root, um, bottom, pelvic floor, belly button in, chin slightly tucked, and we want to send our gaze up to our third eye, just hold that breath, squeezing all the energy up the spine, and release. So when I say squeeze and hold, I want you to do that. Belly button in, pull up through the pelvic floor, chin tucked, third eye gaze, tongue to the roof of the mouth. Now the protection mantra, which we use to clear our auric space and just to become more magnetic. Inhale. Adgare name, jitadgare name, satgare name, siddhigare vingname. Adgare name, jitadgare name, satgare name, siddhigare vingname. One more time. Adgare name, jitadgare name, satgare name, siddhigare vingname. Inhale, apply all those locks, so belly button in, pelvic floor up, chin tucked, energy up the spine, hold the breath, squeeze your body, project out through your aura, down through the crown, up through the crown of your head, and 360 around you, and release. Good, coming into all fours, we start with cat-cow. Inhale up, exhale down. And we're slowly vibrating the sound, sat on the way up, nam on the way down. And go at your own pace. You can start to pick it up once you become a little bit more attuned to it. But at first, just go nice and slow. The idea is to just warm up the spine. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Sat, nam. Sat,
Start to make it a little bit bigger now, moving more through the spine, bigger, deeper breaths, really forcing the air out. On the exhale, I really want you to pull that belly button in, squeeze your butt a little, and then opposite for the big cat, cow. Moving, moving, moving. 10 more seconds. Faster. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, hold. Exhale, curl the spine, hold the breath out. Inhale for neutral. And exhale, press back into child's pose. Bring the palms together and press your third eye down into the ground. And rest here. While you're resting here in child's pose, I want you to really press those palms together and now project through that third eye deep into the ground and feel a balancing between your two hemispheres. So the right and the left, as we press the palms together, we're balancing our energies. And that's the feminine and the masculine, the yin and the yang. Take a deep breath. And exhale. Coming up again into all fours. We're gonna inhale, leg back, exhale, in. 30 seconds. Keeping your hips square to the ground. 10 more. Leg goes straight and all the way in. And inhale out, hold. Push your knee down to the ground, reach the crown of the head. Release, inhale, other leg, and exhale in. 30 seconds. Press down through the palms of the hands. Really, shoulders are square. Sat Nam. Sat Nam. Keep the mantra going in your head. And two more. And hold up. Reach your body as long as you can. Squeeze all your muscles nice and tight. Good. And release. Coming to sitting on your knees here. Give yourself a nice big hug and inhale to the left. Exhale to the right. Just a few of these start to get the spine moving. And this actually is a really calming position. It's really comforting. So inhale left. Exhale right. If you're feeling like going the extra mile here this morning, or whenever you practice this video, practice the mantra Sat Nam. Inhale Sat, exhale Nam. Sat Nam means truth is my identity. It is a powerful mantra in Kundalini. Helps you really find that voice, your voice, your power. Good, last one. Arms up, again. Inhale, exhale. Just the upper torso twist. You can go a little slower. My hands are in Gyan Mudra, so you're just pressing the pointer finger and thumb together. Find some rotation in the spine. Inhale, exhale. Left, right. Few more, really powerful. Inhale, center, apply all the lock, squeeze your entire body, shut your eyes, gaze up to the third eye, tongue to the roof of your mouth, hold.
and exhale. Hands onto your lap, keep your eyes shut. We're going into spinal flex, so heart forward, heart back. Inhale, exhale. We don't want our chin going up and down, so try to keep your chin level. It's just a flexion through the spine. Press, pull, press, pull. Eyes shut, a few more. Find more movement through your spine. Inhale up, hold the breath, pull all the locks, squeeze every muscle in your body, clear your mind, project out through your third eye, and release. Coming onto your feet and standing all the way up for me. Now we're going to inhale up, taking it into a gentle back bend, depends on how flexible you feel this morning. And exhale, touch the ground. So this is a very slow breath. One minute here. Exhale. Inhale up. Exhale down. You might find that you start to get a little bit more mobility into the spine. Use that. Start to take it deeper each time. As you come down, you're stretching out that life nerve, that sciatic nerve. Don't push it, but go to your limit. Like, stretch it out without injuring yourself here. Ten more seconds. Deeper breath. More breath. Last one, inhale up with me. Exhale down and hold. Shake it out. We're here for another 20 seconds, just pause. Rock a little in your feet. Yeah, bend your knees, slowly roll. Okay, now coming down, take your legs wide, and you're going to go into a breath sequence. It goes inhale, hold, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Okay, keep going. Inhale, exhale. Going as low as you can. Last one. Down the center. Inhale, up, exhale, down. Little lower. Inhale, exhale, last one, inhale, hold. And bring your legs together. And butterfly pose. Exhale, exhale, exhale. So breath of fire. Start to really move those legs.
Eyes shut, quicker breath, pump the navel. Last 10 seconds. Three, two, one, inhale. Apply all those locks, tongue to the roof of your mouth, eyes shut, project out through the third eye. And exhale. Coming onto your back now. Bridge pose, inhale up. Down. Inhale, exhale. Squeeze your glutes. It's a perfect way to warm them up for the day. Get some strength in the back of the body. Let your tailbone tap the ground. Eyes can be shut or open. your glutes strong, press your hips as high as they go, and hold. Pull your heels in tighter to your bum without moving them. Hold, hold, hold. Don't breathe. Good, and release. Coming in here, just rocking that out a little bit. Now, coming onto your back, this is called piston abs. So we're gonna do them for about a minute. Back is on the ground, and as one knee comes in, you inhale, and then you exhale, shoot the other one out. Go. Inhale, exhale. Belly button, navel to spine, so you really feel supported. Now, if you need extra support, hands go underneath your bum. Shut your eyes, breathe. Inhale. Exhale, strong, push, push. Stronger the legs, the stronger the breath, the better. This is really good for aligning those lower chakras and strengthening your abs. Again, taking it at your own pace. the howler monkeys. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, both feet out, hold. Lift your chin, hold. And release. Now we're coming into cobra pose. Coming on up, whether you're going into full cobra like this, or just on your elbows, or even just here. I want your heart lifted and eyes shut and breath of fire through the nose. Go. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Try to reach the heart forward. Taking this kind of inversion is so good for the heart center. We're really energizing the posture with a ton of breath. So keep going. Focus up at the third eye, eyes are sh shut. Couple more deep breaths. Breath of fire, I mean, faster, faster, faster. Now inhale, turn over your right shoulder and hold the breath. And exhale, release. Inhale again, center. 
Look over your left shoulder and hold, looking down at your heel. Release, inhale. Look at your right heel. Center, release, inhale. Look over. Good, and release. Pressing back now, shake your hips out into child's pose. And we're gonna bring our arms into a Venus lock. So that means the fingers are just crossed and we're interlacing them. Our forehead comes down into the ground and our hands go over our heads. Now, there's no particular breath here. I just want you to breathe slow, long, deep breaths and feel the energy that you've been creating through this practice. One more slow, deep breath in. Exhale, release. Good, coming into easy pose, we call it, which is just legs crossed, and giving me a few circles. So like I said at the beginning of the video, this is a condensed version. We're doing just a minute or two of each posture. Once you get to know these moves, you can do each one of them up to three minutes, which is what I usually do. It extends the practice into about a 45 minute practice. Go the other way. But it is said, you know, if you don't have the time, it's always okay to shorten the sets. I like that Kundalini doesn't really have hard, fast rules. <laughs> it is a practice of gaining better energy and developing new habits. Good. Now, new breath in this one is quite powerful and fun. Right. Inhale back, exhale cross, inhale back, exhale, throw the bucket over your head. Really fast, here we go. Shut your eyes. Now that you've got it, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Hands are in fists. Three, two, one, inhale, heart forward. Apply all the locks, so pull up through that pelvic floor, chin tucked, tongue to the roof of your mouth, project out through the third eye. Hold. And release. Hands on your knees, inhale, shoulders up, exhale, down. You can shut your eyes now, keep the shoulders going. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Fast through the belly. With all this breath of fire, sometimes it's helpful to have a tissue nearby. Inhale up. Hold, squeeze the shoulders to your ears. And now exhale, we're gonna push the shoulders down and hold the breath out. Reach the neck long. And release. Last two postures you guys are doing so great. Back to interlocking the fingers. Inhale up, exhale down. So not all the way over your head, just up to about, I don't know, your chin or ears and down. 
And the breath is powerful. And if again, we can come back to that sat, no, sat, no, sat, no. This helps pump up your magnetism and it helps clear your aura. And it's literally, I imagine it as like a pump filling up our energy, our field. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Keep going. Stronger breath here. Last 10 seconds. Really make it count. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Three, two, one. Hands up. Flip them. Press them to the ceiling. Roll your eyes to the top of your head. And imagine you're looking through your crown, through your hands, up into the space, up into stars. Good. And just slow, deep breathing here. So your eyes should be shut, and they're really rolled up. And it should almost, you know, you feel the pull in your eyeballs as you reach up and look through the crown of your head, through your hands. Slow, deep breathing. Slow your breath down even more. Keep your eyes up. Press your palms higher. Press, press, deep breathe, breath. And now release the fingertips slowly, trace through your aura, slowly. Feel the energy. Good, and touch the ground, ground yourself for a sec. And now we come into easy pose again, and just shut our eyes. And taking a nice meditative breath. A few slow inhales and exhales. Coming back to an intention for your day. Feeling a deep sense of gratitude for this practice. For the energy you have cultivated. For your breath. And now bringing our palms together, we're going to close this practice with one Sat Nam. Inhale. Exhale. With an inhale. Sat Nam. Satnam, thank you so much for joining me for my morning sadhana kundalini practice. It was really fun to share the condensed version with you guys. Um, if you liked this video, please click the subscribe, share it with your friends, leave me a comment. Um, many more of these to come, and if you like them, let me know. What's your favorite part of kundalini? Is it the breath, or the mantra, or the movements? Um, or just the energy you get every time you show up to your mat. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day.